What's going on guys, it's Kyler the How To Guy123 here and in today's tutorial I'm going to be teaching you guys how to reformat a external hard drive uh, that was used as a storage device on an Xbox One and use it on a PC. This will also work uh, if you use the external hard drive on other consoles like a PS4, PS3, uh, Xbox 360 and uh, consoles like that. But anyways in this case I'm going to be using my external hard drive that I used on my Xbox One and we're going to be using it back here on the PC. So if you go to this PC you'll see uh, you won't actually be able to use your hard drive, your external hard drive, once it was used on the Xbox One. So it's very simple and all you gotta do is uh, you can either minimize or exit out of this PC. And my hard drive is plugged in by the way, make sure that your hard drive is plugged in, uh, obviously. And then you're gonna want to go to control panel and I like to go to control panel by just searching for it. So control panel and then go to system and security and then down here under administrative tools click on create and format hard drive partitions and you're going to need administrative privileges to do that and then once this window is open you'll, you'll see this window here is uh, called initialize disk and you're going to want to make sure that your disk is selected and that use the following partition style for the selected disks is set as master boot record or MBR then click on OK and then once you've done that you're gonna want to, you can uh, maximize this if you want. And you'll see under here, disk three, you'll see the size of your hard drive and it'll say unallocated. You can right click on it and then click on new simple volume. Then it's gonna open this window here and click on next. And then click on next, next again. And it's gonna show here that the this is the size of our hard drive. So click on next. And then you can give it a letter of your choice and I'm going to set mine to G and then uh, click on next and um, under the file system you can set it to whatever file system you want in this case I'm going to set mine to NTFS because it's a, it's a hard drive and uh, that's what I recommend doing if you're using an external hard drive is setting it to NTFS and then you can give it a name if you want so I'll call this Kyle's hard drive I'll call it Kyle's HDD and then make sure perform a quick format is selected and click on next and then finish. Now let, let it do its thing and then when it's done it's going to open a window you'll see well it just opened it but I guess it closed but if we go to this PC you should see your hard drive here. Um, my hard drive is 1.5 terabytes and we have 1.5 terabytes there or just about and it was here you can see that uh, the hard drive is all good healthy primary partition and that you can exit out of that if you want and uh, we can actually go ahead and you know store things in our hard drive and it's all you know good and new so that's pretty much it for this tutorial if this helped leave a like if it didn't leave a dislike and i'll see you guys in the next video